Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a special edition of MedSynapse Podcast. I'm your host, Dr. Nigar, and in this episode, we're thrilled to give you a sneak peek into the upcoming 9th International Conference on Gastroenterology and Therapeutic Gastrointestinal Endoscopy. Joining us today is a true luminary in the field, Dr. Yogesh Shastri. He is not only the course director for this conference, but also the head of department for gastroenterology at NMC Specialty Hospital in UAE. Together, we will dive into the event's exciting lineup of speakers, cutting-edge techniques, and therapeutic breakthroughs. Stay tuned for a glimpse into the world of gastroenterology innovation. Welcome, doctor. Hi. Thank you for joining us today on this podcast. Welcome. Let's begin with the most wanted questions from our audience. The first question, could you please tell us about the purpose and aims of the 9th International Conference on Gastroenterology and Therapeutic Gastrointestinal Endoscopy? Uh, at the outset, I would like to thank MedSynapse to be part, partner with us uh, in uh, our previous conferences as well. So I'll begin the focus of our meeting this year is to showcase the latest trend in gastroenterology endoscopy. Since past years, eight years, we have been doing this Congress as a platform, which is, a, which is for teaching education in the field of gastroenterology, hepatology, and GI endoscopy. So the first aim is to share the major breakthrough and technologies uh, which, and advances which has happened in endoscopy in the last one year. So uh, as you know, this is a rapidly evolving field and we need to be abreast with the latest update. So it will give it give us a platform to uh, impart knowledge to our participants and te- and uh, trainees which we come, and it will be an interdisciplinary exchange of ideas. Another thing that we will be having is various modalities to learn. As you know, that we need to have uh, various uh, sources to learn, which will in- increase our understanding. So we'll have uh, didactic lectures. We have case based panel discussions, we'll have live uh, endoscopy, we'll have hands-on workshop. So this all will lift the skills of the participant. Another thing there are, uh, this conference will allow us to network with our uh, colleagues so that we will have uh, people from various fields in creating and strengthening our clinical collaboration. Also, uh, we have seen in last eight years since the time we have started organizing this meeting, we have got feedback from thousands of participants and we try to improve. So this has become an unmissable event in the calendar of knowledge seekers in gastroenterology uh, in this region. Who is the target audience for this conference and how can they benefit from participating? So the target audience is anybody who is directly or indirectly involved in managing gastroenterology, hepatology, diseases and endoscopies. But uh, it mainly includes the gastroenterologists, the endoscopists, the internists, physicians, surgeons, pathologists, oncospecialists, general physicians, endoscopy technicians and nurses. So our, our conference has benefited scores of doctors and allied healthcare workers and it's the conference is open to all who are willing to learn in gastroenterology or I would say GI knowledge seekers. Could you highlight some of the key topics or sessions that will be covered during the conference? Okay, so uh, this is a tightly packed event over two days. Uh, So uh, almost the entire content is unique, but let me elaborate. On the day one, we have dedicated it to the uh, US. So we focused on thorough US training. So it will begin with didactic practical lectures on day one as how to do U.S. various modalities of U.S. by world-renowned U.S. teachers. This will be followed by dedicated hands-on U.S. workshop. So for this, we have imported special non-animal Ikuma models from Japan, which are uh, only for this meeting. And this is the only meeting in the MENA region where these models are used to learn U.S. They are something like a, a human anatomy, so it helps us to uh, get trained on the scope with uh, the latest U.S. scopes. So for this, I thank Asian U.S. group, which is basically uh, academic interest group, which is not for profit society in Singapore, which is established in more than a decade. And it includes all the healthcare professionals and experts on U.S. from Asia Pacific region. And I'm honored to be one of the members of this esteemed group from UAE. So they help us in organizing this hands-on training. 
So following this hands-on training, we'll have an extensive live EUS session in which we will be transmitting the basic and advanced EUS procedures for the participants to learn. So they will have a lecture, they will have EUS uh, hands-on training, followed by seeing how do you do it in day-to-day -day, uh, world. And following this, the last will be the lectures on common EUS procedures, which are done by and this will be by the experts from all over the US to help them learn. And on day two, we'll have lectures which will cover entire length and breadth of gastroenterology, hepatology, GI endoscopy. We'll have interactive clinical based discussions. We'll have didactic lectures by the uh, panel of presenters covering common clinical problems, including day to day emergencies in uh, gastroenterology. This will be this will guide our audience to know how to approach com common clinical issues in that ideal way. The icing on the cake will be live telecast on the uh, from the best GI institute in the world, which is Asian Institute of Gastroenterology, Hyderabad, with uh, showing a rapid fire of selective uh, interesting cases in the field of therapeutic GI endoscopy. And uh, this has been the traditionally the most popular event in our meeting over the years. So there's a lot in store for the uh, participants in our meeting. Thank you so much, Dr. Yogesh, for giving us a very detailed overview of the whole event. Now, can you please share some insights into the distinguished speakers and experts who will be presenting at the event? So for this year, we have roped in faculties from all over the world, including USA, Hong Kong, Taiwan, Thailand, KSA, Oman, and India. So in all, we have 10 international speakers, including president of uh, prestigious American College of Gastroenterology, Dr. Pratik Sharma is our distinguished speaker, Dr. Nageshwar Reddy, who is Dion of Gastroenterology from Asian Institute of uh, Gastroenterology, Hyderabad. We have Professor Anthony Theo, who is the Director of Endoscopy from Prince of Wales Hospital, the Chinese University of Hong Kong, who is an expert in therapeutic EUS. We have Dr. Amol Bape, who is from uh, Chief of Endoscopy from Dinanath Mangeshwar Hospital in Pune, India who is an expert in third, third space endoscopy in EUS. We have Dr. Abed Lehbi, who is head of the gastroenterology from King Fayyad Medical City, uh, Saudi Arabia. We have Dr. Sandeep Laktakia and Dr. Vinaydi, director of gastroenterology from SL Raheja Hospital, Mumbai, who is a prolific teacher in EUS, who has taught hundreds of students on EUS. And not only these, we have uh, 15 local speakers, including Dr. Shiv Kumar, who is Chief of GI in Cleveland Clinic, Abu Dhabi, Dr. Mazen Taha, who is Head of Gastroenterology in Tawam Hospitals. We also have gastroenterologists from all major institutes from UAE, including Sheikh Shakbooth Medical City, Abu Dhabi, Rashid Hospital, Dubai, Al Qasimi Hospital, Sharjah, and various private hospitals from entire UAE. What do you hope attendees will take away from this event and how might it impact the future of gastroenterology and therapeutic endoscopy? So all the participants will have their individual take home lessons from various array of topics which have been discussed in one roof in a short period of time. I'm sure that each one, each one of us will have something to add to their pre-existing kitty of endoscopic experience and knowledge, whether it will be learning or practicing in its kind there is so much of scientific information which is available for exchange that everybody will benefit from this barter. Based on our past experience, we have experienced an uh, increased level of communication amongst scientific community on diff diff difficult topics which will benefit our attendees. Finally, could you provide some details about the dates, location, and if there are online options available for those who wish to attend virtually? So uh, we have chosen a special date for this event, which is uh, end of this month, which is 29th and 30th of September. It is uh, uh, organized at Bab Al Qasar Hotel, Cornish Road West, uh, Abu Dhabi. We have chosen these specific dates because it's a long weekend. So uh, those people who are working or practicing, they don't have to take holidays specifically for this and they can come and join on both the days because one of them being a public holiday, another being a weekend. So I request everybody to block their days and uh, be there physically with us. However, we are planning to have a virtual online option strictly for those who are not in UAE or those who cannot travel to Abu Dhabi to be there with us. And for that, MedSynums will be our uh, prolific partner to organize this. 
Dr. Yogesh, thank you so much for your time and dedication to advancing in the field of gastroenterology. We look forward to the ninth International Conference on Gastroenterology and Therapeutic GI Endoscopy and on all the incredible insights it promises to deliver. Thank you so much for being here today. Thank you for the opportunity and hope to see you all in the coming meeting. Thank you so much. Wishing you all the best in this event. And to all our audience, this video was made possible by MedSynapse, the leading platform for medical collaboration and knowledge sharing. If you haven't already, be sure to subscribe and register on our platform to stay updated with the latest events and developments in the field of medicine. Thank you all. Have a good day. Goodbye. Thank you.